Imagine a world where you never have to go to the grocery store and never have to cook. All you have to do is turn on your 3D printer and print out a delicious dinner. Food from a spray can slash packet slash printer slash machine is a through line in science fiction from the Jetsons to Back to the Future, offering characters a hyper-processed and futuristic sense of convenience. This idea of ready-to-go meals already exists. Kinda. MREs, or meals ready to eat, are rations used by the armed forces to feed themselves on the battlefield. MREs date all the way back to the Civil War, but modern MREs are usually some kind of shiny packet with a dehydrated meal inside. Soldiers can add water to a second bag, which will release heat via exothermic reaction, stick their sealed MRE inside, and bam, you have a hot home-cooked meal. Well, maybe not home cooked, but you catch my drift. But if you're not ready to enlist in the military for the sake of convenience, may I interest you in a 3D printed cheeseburger? 3D printed food is a lot like 3D printed anything else. Fab at Home was one of the first efforts to bring 3D printing to the kitchen. The project was developed by Cornell University in 2006, and the machine featured a syringe that could extrude pretty much any liquid. This laid the groundwork for more modern 3D printed food efforts like Nova Meat, a company that 3D printed a steak. Yum. It seems like we're still a ways away from instant food in our everyday life, but a boy can dream, damn it. So let's take a look at how instant food pops up in science fiction. In the Jetsons, Elroy Elroy decides what to eat for breakfast on a whim and gets it served to him from a vending machine. The future McFlies rehydrate a pizza in some cheeky Pizza Hut product placement in Back to the Future Part 2. Oh boy, oh boy, Mom, you sure can hydrate a pizza. Food replicators in the Star Trek universe are able to make everything from martinis to a glass of water to a full fried catfish meal. The computer here fixed about the best martini I ever had. In the fifth element, Lilu is able to rehydrate an entire rotisserie chicken by placing a a small pill-shaped object into a device that looks very much like a microwave. And of course, in The Force Awakens, Rey is able to munch on some bread that's made from a powder she mixes with water. All right, I am getting really hungry and I'm gonna go 3D print myself some chicken parm. Thanks for watching, check out more videos on gizmodo.com.